In theoretical general relativity, a geon is a fascinating concept that refers to a self-sustained, non-singular electromagnetic or gravitational wave held together by the gravitational pull of its own field energy. Essentially, it's a form of bound energy, where the wave's energy keeps it intact in a particular region of space, preventing it from dispersing. The concept of the geon was first proposed by physicist John Archibald Wheeler in 1955. Wheeler, a pioneering figure in general relativity and quantum mechanics, coined the term geon by combining gravitational electromagnetic entity. His theoretical investigations were part of a broader effort to understand how energy and fields could interact under the influence of gravity in complex ways. Wheeler's idea of a geon was to explore a model where a gravitational or electromagnetic wave could maintain its structure due to its self-generated gravitational field. This idea was intriguing because it proposed a system where waves were not dependent on a material substance or particles to be stable. Rather, they relied solely on the curvature of space-time to remain intact. In theory, if such configurations were possible, they could provide insight into the nature of space, time, and gravity in a pure wave-based system. One of the most interesting aspects of geons is their non-singular nature, meaning they don't involve a singularity like the one found at the center of black holes. Singularities represent points of infinite density, which break down our current understanding of physics. Geons, however, avoid this problem by not concentrating their energy into a single point, offering a potentially more stable model for gravitational and electromagnetic field interactions. While geons are still a theoretical concept and haven't been observed, they continue to spark interest within the fields of general relativity, quantum gravity, and cosmology. Geons represent a step toward understanding if pure fields, without matter, can exist stably in the universe and contribute to the structure of space-time. If you found this video insightful, make sure to subscribe, like, and share. Credits. Narrated by Narrator's Name.